Sponsoring today's video, we have our monthly sponsor, GVG Mall, offering you a Windows 10 Pro serial key for only $17, and if you use my SKAG code, you get 20% off, lowering the price to $13. After the payment, you'll receive the key in no time, and you simply need to introduce it in your Windows settings, and BAM! You have an activated system. Hello guys, I should keep plays, I'm Fabio Pisco, and welcome to my channel. Today's video is a really, really good day, so I thought, why not do a mining tutorial, an Ethereum mining tutorial? People are looking into this, uh, there are lots of tutorials online, but some of them seem to be um, quite hard to understand for the most common mortal. So, I decided to do a really, really, really easy, really easy, <laughs> oh my god, a really easy tutorial of how to mine Ethereum. Um, some people asked me that before, but I didn't know how to do it, so I just started mining like two weeks ago, and I thought it would be really, really hard, but it is in fact easy. It is in fact pretty easy. But God. The first thing you want to do is to actually uh, create a wallet, so you can get paid uh, of what you're mining. So in this case, we're mining Ethereum, so you need an Ethereum wallet. In this case, you can use this. So my Ether wallet, wallet, just go to Google, my Ether wallet, and you get this website, okay? Just open it, and you have two options here. So you have create a new wallet and access my wallet. In this case, you have create a new wallet because you want two, because you don't have one, so just press on it. Now you have the new wallet by Keystore file, which they say it's not recommended, and by mnemonic phrase also not recommended. So you have here the Mew Wallet, which is a phone app, so you can just select or go to the, to the Google Play, install the Mew Wallet app, okay? Then after that, create your account, then go here again and select Access My Wallet. Then Mew Wallet, and then it will have this, this QR code, uh, QR code, yes, QR, I think it's pronounced like that. So, you open the app on your smartphone, you select the, um, you select the, the camera icon, okay, and then you actually use your camera to, um, to read this QR code, QR code, QR code, whatever, whatever. You use your camera to read this code, and you'll enter, like, here. Okay, the address I have. So now you have a wallet. This is the most important thing, okay? You have some, uh, a wallet to store your Ethereums. At least I have zero now because I didn't reach the, the, the minimum payment to get my Ethereum, okay? Now, we're gonna use this, the Claymore Dual Miner. And why? We're gonna use the Claymore Dual Miner because we can actually uh, use the AMD and Nvidia cards 2 and 2 AMD 345 3457 3, Nvidia or both mixed no problem you can still use several cards and you have no problem mining with them all okay this is the first step uh, so go there download okay and this will appear Download, for example, this one, Claymore's Dual Ethereum Miner, the version 15.0. It's gonna download. Okay, done. Put on the desktop, for example. Okay. Now, open the, the RAR file and... Sorry. And extract it, extract it to your desktop. The password is Claymore. Claymore done now your antivirus is is gonna tell you something at least if it is a good one it's gonna tell you that it is a coin miner but yeah you want a coin miner so just go here for example and select exclude from detection exclude from signature signature from detection ignore once again ignore once again ignore okay now you have a wallet and you have the software to mine. Just open the, um, yes, here. Just open the, um, the folder, and now you have lots of them. Ethereum, Sparkpool, these are the pools. 
Uh, some pools are better than others, just have a higher fee, others have a lower fee, usually the fee is let's say 1%. Um, but yeah, the pool I use is this one, Ether Mine. Okay, for example here, if you go to the Ether Mine and put your address here, for example, copy, go here, ethermine.org, let's go here, for example, now you press here, your address, your wallet address, and search. And this will appear, it will show you your workers active and inactive, and the unpaid balance you have, uh, and how much percentage you have till you actually get paid, okay, for your wallet, to your wallet, uh, the estimated earnings, the reported mega hash per second, and so on, so on, so on. So as you can see, the RX 5700 XT, I called it 5700 XT, but it is actually a 5700 XT plus a 5500 XT, but we'll get there. Now, you have the software and we're gonna use the Ether Mine. So, just press on the right button and go edit. Open it and you have this file, okay? Now, after this file, you will basically uh, delete everything. Just let mode one, so delete all of this, the port, blah, 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 all of this, go to your wallet and you have this address, copy it, my bad, copy it, go here and select your wallet, paste, okay, you have the, the server, in this case it's the UE server, European, if you are on USA, US1, in this case I'm Europe, so Europe 1, you can see this here, for example, uh, let me just see the servers, they have the servers somewhere here. Oh, start mining here, so, okay, so, for example, you have Euro European, so UE1, you have US East and US West, so if you're on US East, US1 here, if you are on US West, then US2 here. In my case, UE1 since I'm European, okay? Now, you have the server here, you have your wallet's number, and now you have the e-worker, and then you put the e-worker. For example, let's imagine you have uh, an RX 5700 XT, an RX 5600 XT for mining, then RX 5600 XT, and then you'll see the name here, when you start mining, it will appear here, here, 56RX, 5600 XT, okay? So basically that's it, so, the server, your wallets, your wallets um, number, and then the name that you want to give your uh, mining machine, let's say, okay? I had some problems, for example, with some of these settings, I had some problems with some of the settings, so I will leave you my settings of the Ethermine uh, with a link in the description so you can actually download them, because for example when I try to use my RX 50, uh, 6800 uh, it, will give me, it will give me an error, and when I try to use for example two cards, two cards at the same time in the same motherboard, it, it was also giving me an error, so I had to change some settings in order to make it work. And the settings I have, that you have the link in the description, will actually work with two cards, four cards, 100 cards, doesn't matter if they are Nvidia, AMD, all mixed together, if, doesn't matter, they will work out of the box, you just have to go there, press two times, and it's mining. So, if you want the easy way, just go to the link in the description and download my settings, okay? What you actually want to do is to downclock and undervolt your GPU to the max, so you can actually, uh, not the VRAM though, so uh, you can actually get the, um, the best uh, power performance combo on mining, because mining mostly uses your VRAM and not uh, your GPU coarse clock and so on, so just downclock and undervolt your core, your core frequency, and keep the VRAM the max you can. So, the tighter timings possible and the higher frequency possible. That will give you more mega hash. And when you actually decrease the frequency uh, and undervolt the core, you will actually get way less power consumption. For example, my 5700 XT is actually uh, consuming around, let's say, 
uh, if I remember correctly, around 93 watts. So it's crazy how it only consumes 93 watts uh, while doing 52 mega ash. So it's pretty nice. No more that bias, just under volting. Okay. I will leave also uh, the mining, the mining uh, profile. Uh, of the 5700 XT and the 5500 XT in the with links in the description if you want to actually see it. So basically that's it guys and then just wait for the for the mining to to go on and on and on till you get some profit some profit sorry um then pronounce <laughs> anyway that's it just as simple as it can be and you are now mining Ethereum okay uh, you also have some profit calculators that you can have here, for example, Ether, Ethereum Profit Calculator, okay? So for example, I'm mining at 70, it's around that, 77 mega hash with around 180 uh, watts consumption. The power costs like 0 0.15 and the pull fee is around, yes, 1%. So I have around... $211 profit per month, which is crazy because I just let those two GPUs there. They are just there doing uh, doing their thing. Uh, as long as I keep the temperatures down, as I undervolt and underclock well, so the temperatures remain great, everything is working fine and I just have profit like that. And the cards won't degrade, the lifespan won't uh, be less than using it for gaming, for example. So, yeah... Yeah, that's it. Create a wallet, uh, download Claymore Duo Miner, uh, edit those settings or download my settings and just put your wallet there and change the name. Uh, and then start doing it. For example, just do this. Start here, then Ethermine. Okay? And it will connect to the pool, as you see here. UE, uh, EU, sorry, one. Then it will do the DAG, which is basically uh, loading the thing. And then it will start finding shares. When you start finding shares, it will start making money to you, okay? So, it is finding a new job, 60 mega hash, okay? And it, in some time, it will find shares and actually give me money, okay? So, that's basically how it works. Once again, guys... Thanks a lot for watching, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and share this video and if you have any doubts, leave them in the comment section because I will try to help you as fast as I can. Thanks a lot for watching and see you in the next video.